hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys my quick and lazy box braids wash day routine so what i'm going to be using in this video is a clarifying shampoo a spray bottle with water in it and some oil as well as the shea moisture no rinse foam cleanser so this cleanser is supposed to help cleanse and also refresh your cornrows, box braids, weaves, and hair extensions. So I've had my box braids in for two and a half months now, going on three. This is the rubber band method box braids. Um, I'm showing you guys right now the buildup that I have that's mainly in the front of my hair. So the first thing I like to do is section my hair off. So what I'm going to do is have two sections in the back and have two sections in the front. Now I'm going to grab my spray bottle with the water in it and spray the water on my roots. And then I'm going to go in with the shampoo and focus the shampoo on my scalp and my roots where all the buildup is. Once I'm done with the first section, then I um, braid that up and then I go on to the second section. So right here, I'm making sure that I'm loosening up all that build up so that way when I rinse my hair out, I, it's gone. now I'm gonna go hop in the shower and rinse out the shampoo so I'm only gonna focus the shampoo on the front of my hair just because that's where I mainly have my buildup and then that's where the shea moisture no rinse cleanser comes in so the cleanser is a mild shampoo alternative that you use that you don't have to use water with and it's supposed to help remove dirt and residue from your hair when it's in a protective style such as cornrows, box braids, weaves, and extensions. So I like to use this um, on like my lazy wash day. So basically it's supposed to be like, you know, a dry shampoo type of situation. And um, so I use this on the back of my hair because obviously I didn't use the shampoo on the back of my head. And then I also use it on um, the ends of my um, box braids, which I didn't use shampoo on. The only reason I didn't just use the no rinse foaming cleanser because I had all that build up because I have been using um, hair fertilizer and it has like petroleum jelly in it. So it's definitely going to cause some um, build up so that's the reason I had to use the clarifying shampoo for the front of my hair to get rid of the build up and then I went in with the no rinse foaming cleanser so now I'm gonna go ahead and seal in the moisture of the cleanser and as well as the water because I just washed out the shampoo with oil and because you got to make sure that your hair is moisturized while it's in a protective style and um, and then that's basically it and then I just let my hair air dry um, some you know I don't like when 
the hair is dripping all over the place so I'll wrap my hair up in a towel for about a good 30 minutes and you know that should do the job and yeah and that's it that's my quick and lazy box braids wash day routine so if you guys have any question or comments um go ahead and leave that in the comment section and i'll see you guys in the next one oh also don't forget to like comment and subscribe